Once all equipment is energized and initial run times are completed, the plant processes are ready for startup. During processor system startup, all subsystems start to function as one system. Mechanical piping is configured for operation and process flows are slowly started. Electrical systems are energized and operational and power transfers are slowly increased. Automation systems are enabled, control and protection systems are verified, and fault scenarios are tested. The equipment undergoes analysis at each stage and startup checklists are completed. The consultant, subject matter expert, and client will want to witness each stage of startup. This is one of the topics covered in my three-day mini course on commissioning and startup. To get started with the full course, please go to commissioningandstartup.com where you can sign up for free. My name is Paul Turner and I want to help you survive and thrive in your commissioning career.